Good evening. Hello, everyone. This is Deanna Hawkins with Foxy Paparazzi. Welcome. So glad to see you all. I hope you uh, are having a good beginning of the holiday season. And now, boy, it's right on us. And it's almost Thanksgiving and busy, hurry, hurry and company. And But then Christmas. And what a time to celebrate. Hi, Debbie. I'm so glad you're here. And Cindy. Oh, welcome. Boy, have I got some nice things tonight. I can hardly wait for you to all see them. Oh, good evening, Catherine. How are you? Let's see, I got to wave over here. <laughs> um, anyway, so what I thought I'd start out with is the November special that Paparazzi's having, and it's for a free necklace, which is just awesome. If you order from my site at Paparazzi, $35 or more, you can uh, win a free global grandeur necklace. It is just beautiful. Glamour. Go global glamour. <laughs> So I'm so glad to see you, and I hope you have fun tonight with me. Um, the next thing that I wanted to mention was that I want you to look at the stream and see all the beautiful Z collection that we have, and they are wonderful Christmas presents and last a lifetime, really classy, beautiful, beautiful necklace and matching earring sets. And then the last thing before I get started on all the goodies is that if you want to order, all you have to do is say sold in your comments. Ta-da! Easy. And then after the show, if you would please message me, text me, email me um, with your name, address, phone number, and a current email. Thank you very, very much, Cindy. You're always so sweet to me. Thank you. Nice, nice thing to say. Thank you. And, oh, yeah, yeah, we have lots of pretty stuff. This is the party goer, and I'll talk about that in a little while. But anyway, right now, to start, I'm going to go with very fortunate, and I am, and I hope you are too, and I hope all the good things in your lives are prominent. And so let's go with very fortunate in blue. I have one of these. And it is just spectacular. I'm going to leave the earrings and the other necklace up here. And I'll talk about that pretty soon, too. But the earrings are the same in both sets. So there you go. Um, first, oops. I'm going to mess it up already. There we go. And this is very fortunate. And I have it doubled on here because it's very long and it can be shortened. And this is number 287. And look at that Caribbean blue diamond color. This is number 287. There we go. Very fortunate. It's a tassel necklace, and it has the beautiful rings with the rhinestones in them. And then it has reversed stones in it. If you can see from the side, see how they come out? Instead of a flat, the flat side on top, like a regular diamond, they go on the outside. Very pretty, huh? Thank you. Let's see if I can get a... I love those little hearts. Isn't that pretty? Very fortunate. Let's see if I can get a very good close-up for you. That's a little better. Let's see if I can get closer. There, that's a little better. That's very fortunate. Isn't it beautiful? And that's 287. 288 is spark for attention. This is cute, cute. Hmm. 
number 288. And these are spark for attention and they're hematite and silver. They're about a two and a half inch hoop. And what's nice about them is that they're very lightweight. Number 288. Aren't they pretty, Catherine? I thought you'd like those. Spark for attention. And then the next thing we have is empirical L ev the <laughs> empirical elegance number 289 this is really elegant it's long and you can shorten it or not it has the matching earrings all lead and nickel free chain earrings to match and they are the um high polished silver they pretty And then the necklace, I'll hold it for you first. It's on a crescent, has a crescent moon shape, hematite and smoky crystal stones in it. No. For you. Isn't that beautiful? Empirical elegance. And boy, it has some beautiful, beautiful bling. Very nice. So glad you could all join me again. It's so special to have you here. And again, I think that's 289. Let's see. Oh, now we have another nice one. This is a gold bracelet called Wire Warrior. This is number 290. No. Yeah. Ta da 290 wire warrior in gold and this is a really nice bracelet you can see the sheen of the gold and it just wraps right around your wrist very nice great for small wrists wire warrior in gold And that's 290. Okay. 291 is hardened heart. This is relatively new. It's long and gold. 291. And the earrings are an exact match to the heart pendant. And they're in a polka dot stamp. Get that up there so you can see it better. And then it has a nice, heavy, high polished gold chain. And this is the pendant. And it's very fluid, isn't it cute? Let's see if I can turn it around for you. There we go. Pretty, huh? Hardened heart. And it is lovely. I'm gonna do a quick, a quick show. And there it is.
Isn't that pretty? I like silver and gold. This just depends, I guess, on the occasion. But these are great for any time of year. Very, very pretty. Hardened hearts in gold. It keeps wanting to turn around the opposite way for me. Okay, and next we have Colorfully Confident in Red. For those of you that love red and silver, I sure do. This is great for the holidays. This is called Colorfully Confident, number 292. Two ninety two, and these silver beads are just gorgeous. Different sizes, different shapes, and different stamps. And then the beads, the red beads, have a variegated brushed black on them. This is so pretty in real life. You just can't even imagine. It is lovely. And I'll back it up a little bit so you can see it. And then I'm going to bring it up close so you can see the detail in these links. They are really pretty. Let's see. There, that's a little better. Aren't those nice the way they sheen in the light? Number 292, Colorfully Confident. Number 293, we have some pearls, Royal Refinement. This is a nice little gold and pearl set. Matching pearl earrings, $293. I almost kept this for myself. It's so cute. There we go. It's alternating rhinestones and pearls. Isn't that just gorgeous? This is one of my faves. Now, I really like the double chain on it. Not cooperating very well, but boy, isn't that just lovely. Touch it up a little bit. And this is a good all around piece dress or not. Royal refinement. It's just not coming in very well, but it is just strikingly beautiful. And this is 293. All right, come on, wake up, everybody. Tell me hello. Let me know you're out there. <laughs> Let's see what we have next. 294. Oh, this is called Margarita Masquerade. It's really a cute one. This will go with everything for you girls that look great in white. This is number 294. The earrings are cute little white globes. It's on a heavy silver chain with 
alternating beads and stampado uh, and smooth rings. If you can see that. And then toward the bottom, then it gets. There are five chains here. And it is beautiful. I'm going to stand up for a second so you can see how long it is. And it's about, oops, it's about waist length. And it is beautiful on. And this is Margarita. Just think of Margaritaville. Only masquerade. What happens in Margaritaville stays in Margaritaville. Thank you. Okay, let's see what we have next. Oh, this is Traveling Trendsetter. I, I got this in purple and it had a flaw in it, so I didn't get to sell it. But they came out right afterwards with these in pink, and they are really pretty. If you're a pink, a color pink signature girl, this is your piece. $2.95. Here we are. The cute little bead earrings. And these are almost fuchsia. They're more of a hot pink than a fuchsia, but they're real pretty. And I'll put it over here on our little girl. And as you can see, and then it has the uh, glassy opaque beads. Isn't that cute? And this is two ninety five. Traveling trendsetter. I'll bring it back a little ways for you. Nice, huh? Great for the holidays. And next, we're going to get into a little bit of the southwestern styles and blues and and uh, the more earth earthy looking jewelry. This is called uh, Sedona Stan Sandstone. I guess I'm tongue tied tonight. And it's a beautiful turquoise pendant necklace. It's number two ninety six. There we are. Cute little turquoise round bee, ball um, earrings. And it has a serpentine chain. You can see round serpentine. Let's get up here. And then the pendant is a teardrop turquoise pendant. Very plain, very classy. You can see the marbling. That's a better shot of the uh, serpentine chain too. This cannot be sized because the ends are capped uh, the way that they make the chain because it's woven. But isn't that just beautiful? And again, S Sedona Sandstone, long turquoise number 296. There you go. Number 297 is gorgeously gypsy. This is a beautiful silver bracelet. It has the Aztec or South American design in it. And it's a regular bangle, just a regular silver bangle. Number 297. Here it comes. And you'll be able to see, now you can see 
all the the stamp in it it is really pretty there it comes very very nice and it has this the smooth high polished cuff ends on it you know the go everything silver bracelet number 297 And that's, <clears throat> excuse me, gorgeously gypsy. So, everybody got all your Christmas shopping done? Ha, 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 ha. Oh, let's have a look at some desert guide. This can be, uh, a, I think they advertised for a man more than they did a woman but I think it'd look great on girls too. So this is called Desert Guide. It's leather and turquoise. And it's number 303. And it does not come with earrings. These are glass beads and turquoise beads alternating. And it is really pretty. And then it's got the wrapped leather woven and then tied off and wrapped, drawn through each bead. Very classy. Let's see if I can get that a little bit better close up so you can see. There you go. Isn't that nice? And it's just, you know, just below the collar for a man. A little bit a little bit lower than that for a woman isn't that pretty and this is number 303 again and now let's get into some others these are how long is that one the um the man's it's probably about 18 inches is what I'm guessing. I did not measure it. it. Oh, I forgot to mention that it does have, huh? I think it's about an 18 inch, Cindy. But it is really, really cute. And my fingers aren't working, so I can't get it undone. Okay, there we go. Yeah, that's a good 18. It has, oh, and I didn't mention also that it has a lava, the center ball in, in, in it is from lava, black lava. Real cool looking. And then it has the button station to clasp. I just thought this was really neat. I think it's a great guys or girls necklace. Number 303. And now we're going on the roam. This is number 299. Right around here. <coughs> Excuse me. Number 299 on the roam again. This one's silver and it's kind of a, a earthy sandstone has matching chain earrings very nice and it's a triple hanging pendant i can hold it up still and then you can see the marbling in it you can wear it either way it's a one of those front and back so it has a lot of character. No two of these are alike, and I only have one. This is on the Rome again. And it's number 299. And if you like this one, isn't it? It is unique. I like things that other people don't have. <laughs>
And number 300, we have gold. And this is also on the realm again. It also has the chain earrings. Very delicate, very nice because they're so lightweight and they don't break out your ears. And this is has turquoise on the pendants. Isn't that pretty? And I have one of these, only one. So as you wear it, and I do, like I've said before, I like jewelry that moves and has character, and this has unique character on the realm again. Isn't that pretty? And I do like the way turquoise and gold look together. And this is sizable. All righty, then now we have some on natural earrings on the other side of me. These are number 301. They're called Simply Stagecoach. And I love these. They go with almost everything. You can wear them dress or with jeans. And aren't those cute? They have the marbling in them, just like the pendant does. And I have several pieces on the uh, stream over at the group that will match these earrings too. So they're a great all around piece. This is number 301, Simply Stagecoach. Yeah, I like all of them too, Catherine. Gosh, it's difficult having a, a sense of um, discipline by not saying, oh, I gotta have one of those, I gotta have one of those, I gotta have one. Oh, yeah, I just can't pass that up. <laughs> And the next one is called Nature's Bounty. And a lot of you girls really liked this on the stream. I'm, I'm glad you did. I'm partial to just about everything. But having a history of being a silversmith, I really do appreciate silver and turquoise. This is number 302. And it's a bangle bracelet too. A cuff. Excuse me. What's discipline, Catherine? I hear ya. And wait till you see this. Check it out. It's got the triple band and the feather on the side of it. Isn't that just striking? I love this bracelet. You can wear it this way. This or that. Isn't that pretty? Has the twisted and the smooth band. Isn't that pretty? Again, that's number 302. And it can, it can. Uh, size down a little bit. It's big enough for a woman with a large wrist, but it can squeeze a little carefully because it is soldered. And then next, Cindy, you were asking about some things. So I'm going to talk about Foxy, our mascot, first. Thank you, Cindy, for getting Foxy for our good luck charm. Um, tonight, she's wearing a little necklace, but it's really a bracelet. It's called Spotlight Starlight. This is gold and rhinestone. It is so cute. And again, this is another one of those all around basic bracelets, but it's on a double chain. And you can only see it a little bit on Foxy. She loves to model, by the way. I'll take it off so you can see. And it has an extension, all the necklaces and the bracelets. 
that are like this have extensions on them, but it has the larger rhinestones in it. So you can see a really nice little piece. There we go. I can get it to focus for you. There we go. Their bevel set. Everything's five dollars. Foxy says hi back, Cindy. Anyway, this little bracelet. Spotlight Starlight. It is just adorable. Five five dollar. And then the next one I have that I, this is number 326. And I'll put this on her so you can see it. This is number 326. If you have a really small anklet, I think you probably could wear it as one, Cindy. You could probably wear that as an anklet. And I have a lot of anklets too, and they're beautiful. This is 326. And I'll tell you the name of it in a second. Starry Sequins. Doesn't she look great in silver? And this is leather. And I'll take this necklace off her ear. Starry Sequins. And it's also the bracelet I'm wearing tonight. These are, well, like I said, they're all so comfortable, soft, sizable, and a superior bling. If you are a bling girl, you will love this. It, this will show clear across the parking lot. It's beautiful. <laughs> Thank you, Cindy. Isn't that pretty? And flexible, soft, just the nicest leather. And again, 326. And we'll put little Miss Foxy back. And 325. All righty. 326 for Cindy. You betcha. You betcha. Best sister, sister in law I ever had. Okay. Anybody else? Now's your chance. And Cindy has 326. Thank you, Cindy. I appreciate it very, very much. This next piece is called Give Me a Roost for you people who love feathers. These are brass feather earrings, number 304. And they are a statement all by themselves. They're brass with the uh, amber stones in them. And the camera just does not pick up how gorgeous these are. They are really beautiful. And I know I've sold some of you ladies some matching pieces that you could wear these with. And they're surprisingly not that heavy. Um, they would be for me. I have skinny earlobes. But uh, for you girls that have a little meat on your ears still, you'd really like these. Let's get a... Huh? 
a little better focus on them. There we go. Aren't those pretty? So give me your roost, girls. And they do. Even back here, I can see them sparkle even under this light. Nice, huh? Yeah. Mine didn't used to be. But I guess that's what happens when you get mature. <laughs> okay, now I have another one. Oh, you're going to love these. These are called Rippling Refinement. I only have one pair of each, so you'd be unique. Um, this is number 305. And these are big rings and very striking. Oh, yeah, they do. They really do. There we are, 305, Rippling Refinement. These are uh, gunmetal with rhinestones. And then they have the alternating ring with the gunmetal and the rhinestones in between. And they are just gorgeous. These are Rippling Refinement. And I got to tell you, I get some of the best hostess gifts. If you want to have a party, if you want to be a consultant, I'll tell you, more times than not, I just love the hostess gifts that they send me. Aren't those pretty? Rippling Refinement, number 305. And number 306 is also Rippling Refinement. And these are in silver. And they have hematite and ruby and black rhinestones in them. And they are a deep ruby red. You can see them. Aren't those pretty? Hostess gift, hostess reward. Are you like me? <laughs> I don't know. You never know. You never know who's going to pack your box. But I just love these rippling refinements. And if I can get a focus back on them again. There they are. Aren't those pretty? Three oh six. I've got a I've got a culprit. There we go. All righty. And no, I know I'll take a little quick couple of minutes to tell you to go down the stream. It's kind of buried now because I've been posting some pretty pieces. But look down the stream and go to Paparazzi Showroom. I left a link there for you so you can see mine and what my strong points are, the my favorite kinds of jewelry. And you can it'll help you show where your strongest uh, preferences for certain types of jewelry are. And share it with me. And then I can start ordering things specific to you. And that's what a personalized consultant is for. So I want you to take advantage of me. I want you to go and I want you to answer just the few questions that they are. And nothing hard, just quick fun. Takes five minutes. And then post your link in the comments underneath the, uh, the showroom uh, post that I posted there. And then it'll help me get to know you a little bit better too. So just so you know, I wanted to let you know. Um, <clears throat> I want you to come in. I want you to shop my boutique. I'm just chomping at the bit for company for, for jewels. Ha ha. So you'll have a blast. You will. There are going to be things that are just going to eye candy you until you just can't resist. 
That's the idea. Um, anyway, like I say, even if you can't afford to buy anything, maybe you want to host a party because either way you still earn free bling. And the more you sell in your party for as many guests as you have, the more free gifts you get. So think about it. It's a lot of fun. We have treats and snacks and just a good time. And it gets you out of the house gives you that breather from whatever it was in your day and then you end up with something beautiful to wear that makes you feel good and can't beat that so let's move on uh the next piece is called stone aura these are new and they're tiger eye and you will just love it I like most every color, and I'm very fortunate because I can wear brown. A lot of women don't like brown, but if you're a brunette with golden tones, a red head, um, a toe head blonde would look real good in this too. Number 307. Here we are. And here are the matching earrings. And they are so pretty. There we go. I'm, I'm messing them up on the backward side. But the light, when the light shines through this tiger eye, you can see all the golds and browns and blacks. I'm going to get a, a better shot for you. It comes on a heavy chain and it is adjustable. It has a beautiful uh, stamped bevel. And look at the, oh, I have glitter on my finger. See, I even grow bling. This is the most gorgeous. And it has a lanyard on the bottom of it. So if you want to wear it with a name tag or a key or a watch, it has the lanyard on it, or it can be removed. And even the lanyard it is a nice lobster claw, and it also is stamped. So it's even decorated to match the rest of the necklace. And again, look at how pretty that is. Isn't that beautiful? I just love this. And again, this is Stone Aura. Isn't that pretty? Oh, here's my little teeny sweetheart. This is number 308. And it's a solitaire rhinestone or solitaire diamond look. And this is called Diamonds for Days. And if you like diamonds, you're going to really like this one. Ah, oh, there we go. Has a matching earring. Nice petite chain with the extension if you want it longer or shorter. And look at that. Stationed bars. I think it has six little diamonds above the solitaire. This is diamonds for days. And I'll put it back on here so you can see it a little better. This is number 308. I'm having a little trouble seeing it. Let's see. Here we go. 
Come on. There we are. Diamonds for days. Isn't that pretty? Now you can see it. Doesn't look like a, that just does not look like $5 to me. This looks way more expensive. Beautiful. Diamond for days, number 308. Okay, we're going to look into your heart and have a little bit of rose gold now. And this is one of my favorites, number 309. Rose gold, heart and necklace and earring. There we go. These earrings are so cute. Look at the uh, scroll work on them. They're a nice filigree stamp. There you go. And they are pretty rose gold. It's too bad the camera doesn't pick up the color because it is just really beautiful. 309. It has a serpentine chain. And look at the lot. The, you can see through the heart. So no matter what direction it goes, it has the beautiful um, stamp on it. So it, it can be worn either way for a righty or a lefty. And this is look into your heart. You can kind of see it up against the purple a little bit better, the rose color in it. And again, number 309. So look into your heart. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, Romantic Razzle. You're going to love this. This is the one I was telling you about, Catherine. This is a deep blue moonstone. Royal blue. This is number 311. Cindy and I both love moonstones. You can see them glowing already. And this is on a silver twisted chain. And very delicate, very nice. Has three little diamonds just above the bevel. And now you can see the the glow. Isn't that beautiful? And it's so delicate and pretty. This is number 311. I'll just pop it over here on this for you. You get a little idea of the size of it. Isn't that pretty? Yeah, I love them too. Romantic Razzle. Razzle Dazzle, yeah. And next, I'm going to show you a few moonstones now. I know you like them. This is called Castled Tranquility. It's number 312. Matching moonstone earrings. It's the, the big round moonstones. And you 
kind of see the the reflection in them. Standard silver chain and a striking black moonstone with a castle on the bottom. You can see it. And out in the daytime, this can be more day nor day or night, but in the daytime, oh man, does it shine. That's a little better shot of it. Isn't that nice? Love moonstones. Oh, did it? Did it for you, Cindy? The diamond cut? Oh, I love those two. And that's number 312, Tasseled Tranquility. Um, oh, and I was going to tell you I have something else to go with it. And this is called Malibu Mist, and I only have one. And it looks really nice with the uh, pendant. And it's also a black moonstone ring. Let's get up here. And you can see it. And the top, it goes the other direction. So you get the glow from that moonstone no matter what direction you're in. Isn't that beautiful? These are brand new. Malibu Mist. I love these rings. They do have some real pretty ones. And if you need an idea what it looks like on your finger. Nice. Malibu Mist. And I'll tell you a number here in just a sec. Oh, that's also number 312. This was supposed to be a set. Duh. <laughs> I will go separate on them if you don't want both. But they do make a beautiful set. So if you just say 312 necklace or 312 ring, I'll get it. Okay, now let's go for a green. You're going to love this. This is 313, maybe. Hello? Don't you love it when that happens, when you're looking straight at something and then you don't see it? Okay, let me go back here. It's called Sparkling Spectacle. And I know I'm looking right at it. At least I thought I was. Okay. Well, since I don't see it, when I do see it, I'll come back to it. <laughs> oh, how embarrassing, huh? I guess I'm having one of those days. First, I couldn't talk. <laughs> okay, so we'll move along and then I'll see it. The next one is called Top of the Pop Charts, and this is a green blue uh, moonstone bracelet. It's really cute, 314. Number 314. And it also has the triple band. And this is a lovely moonstone. Very small. Now you can see the detail. Just a little bangle. 
just a little bangle and it'll go with all those other pretty moonstones the green So you get an idea how small it is on your wrist. It's it's a good one for people with small wrists. And it's number 314. Okay. And let's see what's next. Oh, this is the Tina from the Z collection. You'll love this. Okay. This is the only piece tonight that I have that's $25. It's from the Z Signature Collection, and it's number 315, and this one's the Tina, and it is substantial. These are the most dynamite necklaces, and you would not be able to touch one of these in a department store for under $100. So you, the $25 value is just superb. It has seven layers. It has the uh, ballroom inset rhinestones, the matching earrings. Let me come back just a smidge. This is so absolutely gorgeous. And it's $25. This will make absolutely the best Christmas present that somebody could get. They are absolutely gorgeous. And I'll put this over here so you get a good look. And it is beautiful. There you go. This is the Tina, $25 from the Z collection. This is the only one I have, and they do not make these anymore. This is from the 2018 collection, and the 2019 collection just came out, oh, what, a couple of months ago now. And so they have a whole new line, but these are no longer available. And they are striking. So you think about that and you look down the stream and then when you want just that perfect speechless gift for your loved one for Christmas, this is it. This is the one, the Tina. Okay, and the next one that we have is called Garden Dream. These are cute little white earrings, and they're very lightweight. These are number 316. And they're Garden Dream. And look how cute. Are those just so cute? And they're light and fluid they just wiggle everywhere yes that's true <laughs> it weighs about five pounds <laughs> nah it doesn't weigh quite that much cindy isn't that nice but it is it is a substantially uh weighty but not to make you feel like you're hanging your head and this is number 316 in the garden. Aren't those pretty? They have rhinestones and white beads and the cute little white teardrop. Number 316. Now flip them over one more time while there's a focus so you can see them again. 
Aren't they beautiful? Festive, fun, great for the holidays. Next, we have prima donna drama. These are the cutest gold post earrings. And I didn't get to them the last time I was going to show them to you, but they are. And they're great for the holidays. They'll show up a block away, number 266. These are gold with square cut rhinestones in them. And look at those. Oh, my gosh. These are seriously serious. Oh, yes. I had to have a pair myself. These are perfect for all around earrings and for really dolling up. Number 266. Prima Donna Drama. Oh, and now here we go, Sam. We're going to talk about the party goer. This is the party goer that I'm wearing in purple. Three chains. Isn't that cute? Isn't it festive? Can you see the bottom? Cute, huh? Love it. But wait. I have colors. Colors. Here it is in blue. And isn't that pretty? This is number 317 in blue. And this is the party goer. Isn't it great? Number 317 is the party goer in blue. And if you'd like it in purple, just say number 317 purple. I just think this is so fun and festive. Has They both have, all of them have matching earrings. I. I chose not to wear them because I was wearing diamonds and the sparkles and I wanted a little bling. So, but the, the earrings are just your plain standard little ball. And then again, if you like that, I have it for number 129. This is the party goer in green. And this is a nice winter green, kind of a, a lighter forest green, but it's the same necklace, only in green. The party goer. And I'll put that over here and show you. These are such fun necklaces. There we are. There it is in green. And this is a good green because it does blend with other lighter or darker greens or even, even on the black it looks nice, I think. And the green is number 129. Party goer. Okay, and then next we have number 318. These come in two different colors. Simple glisten, and they're a basic, you know, one of your basic staple jewelry pieces. Number 318 in gold. And these are such cute little earrings. Very lightweight. Again, these are a great everyday, or you can dress them up. Hello, Shireen. 317 blue for my Cindy Sue. I love you. I will put that right over there in your bag. 
How are you, Shireen? How's it going? I hope you're not working too hard on all your jobs. You sure are gorgeous. Shireen, I tell you, her phone and her selfies are just stunning. She's a beautiful, beautiful young woman. I just had to say it. Are those cute? Number 318 in gold. These are simple glisten. And number 319 is also simple glisten. Okay, come on there. And they're in silver. And they're identical to the gold. There we are. Aren't those cute? And they are. They're just lightweight, and they go with anything. Simple Glisten, 319. Mm -hmm. Oh, there's that one that I was missing. There we go. Okay. And this time we're going to see some of my kind of shine. This is number 320. Maybe. I've done this before. Number 320 in gold. And my kind of shine. These are posts. Absolutely. Bling City. Aren't those pretty? Hi, Jessica. Where you been, girl? Glad to see you. I'm glad to see you. Aren't those pretty? My kind of shine. Number 320. And number 321, again, posts, my kind of shine. And now you can see them close up. This is the pair I have on. Let's see there. They're not a huge uh, hoop. But they have huge, huge sparkle. Well, all right, let's try the number thing again. There it is. Now we'll get that bling thing. Look how pretty those are. Again, another basic hoop that will go with anything. Oh, well, Jessica, how come you didn't bring any candy over here to me? <laughs> All right, Catherine, 321. These are yours. Beautiful, aren't they? And I do. I like posts. My ears have become fragile. So these are excellent because they don't break you out and they're not too heavy. And the next piece we have is called Timeless Tranquility. This is really pretty. <clears throat> this is a very delicate necklace. And um, it would make a marvelous gift. Number 322. Matching earrings, the uh, high polished diamond cut kind of gold chain. These really do just bling out all over the place. And this is the solitaire. And it's a floating um, 
Well, it looks like it's floating. It really isn't, but it has depth, and it looks like it's a floating stone in the center of the oh. um, the setting. And here's what it looks like. Isn't that pretty? This is such a, a, a gorgeous piece in real life. And again, this can go with just about anything because it's got the clear white stone. We'll get it. There it is. Very pretty. You can see it kind of floating there. But it does have the, it has depth. And it won't fall out. So that's 322. And number 323 is my last piece for the night. And this is the same necklace in silver with a diamond polished chain. And this one has the Caribbean blue stone in it. And it is dynamic. This is a one of a kind that you will absolutely love. Isn't that beautiful? And this is Timeless Tranquility in Silver and Blue. Again, it's a floating stone. Oh, yeah, that's much nicer. And that's number 323. And I wanted you girls to know, or girls and guys, I can't always see all of you. But I wanted to let you know that I think I'm going to just go live every week now until Christmas. And then I'll give you plenty of opportunity to stock up on all your goodies for Christmas or for Thanksgiving or birthdays during the holidays, your uh, New Year's jewelry when you get all dolled up to go have some fun. And I just wanted to let you know that I appreciate you all so very much. And I look forward to seeing you again real soon. Um, happy holidays. And we're just going to get shaking it. And I'll see you again next week. And I'll have some more beautiful, beautiful pieces for you. And if you, if you have any questions, my phone number is right there at Foxy's Paparazzi, the group, and the page at Facebook. And you can also find me as a consultant. You can type in at the Paparazzi site every week. Yeah, yeah. I know. I got to get used to this because it's jitter time for me, you know. But um, knowing that there are people that care about me, like me, love me, and just want to look at my jewelry, doggone it. Come on over. Give me a call. The phone number's everywhere. The address is right there. So, and if you're in Canab, Canab Creek Drive, you can't miss the house. You can't miss the boutique. Just come on in Monday through Thursday, 10 to 4. And if you have pickups or you just want to browse and, and you haven't, um, you just get off work at five o'clock, give me a call. I'll gladly open the door and let you shop. Or if you don't get off until six or seven, give me a call. I'd love for you to see the boutique and all the jewelry. So anyway, I will say goodnight for now and 
God bless you. Have a great, great weekend the rest of this week and weekend. And I'll see you probably, I'm hoping, Tuesday. So you'll hear from me, and I hope to hear from you. Goodbye. God bless. Thanks for coming.